One thing that's become very apparent with COVID-19 is that there's no single symptom that is universal for everyone who has the disease. But one of the most common is smell loss, especially early sudden smell loss. So when someone loses their sense of smell associated with COVID, it seems to be very sudden. They go from being able to smell to not being able to smell at all within minutes or hours. There are a growing number of studies now that suggest 50 to 70% of individuals with COVID-19, even if they don't have another symptom, are experiencing smell loss. So the National Institutes of Health is awarding a, a specific grant to assess the ability of smell tests to predict COVID-19. In our new study, we will be testing two different ways to use those smell tests. One is we will assess people who have tested positive or negative for COVID-19 and test their ability to smell, to see if smell testing is predictive of a COVID-19 diagnosis. We will also be approaching different types of communities, residential communities, workplaces, small towns, and such, where we will ask a small number of people to take smell tests on a regular basis to see if the emergence of smell loss in that sentinel population can be a warning sign of the beginning of community spread of COVID-19. So even though vaccines seem to be on the horizon and COVID testing is becoming more accessible in a variety of environments, there's still plenty of people that have a hard time getting tested or being tested regularly enough to screen for COVID-19. So augmenting that type of testing with smell testing could provide an inexpensive and distanced way of identifying people who have acquired COVID-19 and helping them to get treatment or isolation early on. We've known for a long time that viruses can cause smell loss, even after influenza or a common cold. It was really surprising, however, how dramatic and how pronounced smell loss is with COVID. Uh, luckily, just in the last couple of years, we launched the UF Health Smell Disorders Program here at UF Health to help patients who have experienced smell loss and to also to facilitate this kind of research that will allow us to identify the mechanisms of loss and hopefully develop new treatments.